was very fortunate to travel to Nook and be able to meet Inuk uh, there and we were looking through his portfolio. I was really impressed by um, how innovative he is and all of the different materials he work in, uh, works in. Um, but in particular, I saw the images of the um, work he did at the North Atlantic House during the, uh, the UN Climate Change Summit. Uh, where he covered half of the building with uh, an iceberg structure and it just clicked for me that this would be a really exciting thing to do uh, for our exhibition Saga Han during the summertime which would bring that northern element to the exhibition as well as raise awareness of the environmental concerns that affect people living in those regions. Um, so we met with uh, Inuk and we talked about that and initially uh, my colleagues uh, Greg Hill and Candice Hopkins had decided that perhaps we should consider having the front entrance of the Great Hall as the iceberg and people would enter into it. Uh, but then when we discovered that uh, there was maintenance to be done on the National Gallery of Canada's Great Hall, all of a sudden Inuk uh, had a much larger canvas to work with and he rose to the challenge uh, beautifully. So everything came together in a beautiful, very serendipitous way. How's uh, some of the reactions from, from people here in Ottawa and people this, visiting? Yeah, this has definitely been one of the most popular features for uh, the National Gallery, for the exhibition Saga Han, but also throughout the city of Ottawa. It's been one of the most photographed uh, things this summer including on Canada Day when the fireworks were let off behind uh, the wonderful Iluliak.